This is home for me, just to let you know. I'm not going nowhere. All right. Okay. Oh. I am so sorry. I had to laugh about You just that. cracked yourself I, that up. Just, I, it tickled me. What tickled you? It's Justin Diego back with another binge worthy video. And today, we have to talk about how The Real Housewives of Atlanta is gearing up to start filming the new season and how things are really starting to look really hopeful for season 16. If you've been a loyal binge watcher, then you already know that I've been covering The Real Housewives of Atlanta reboot rumors for a while now, and we've already discussed Candy Burris leaving the show after 14 years practically leaving Bravo with no choice but to double down on their plans to do a full Atlanta Housewives reboot. Oh, hell, I paid double for that. And I know I was the main one speculating that Candy probably left Real Housewives of Atlanta once she found out that Phaedra Parks is coming back, but I don't think that I really feel that way anymore. I said what the f I said, so what? So what? <laughs> yes, yeah, since I covered that story, so much has changed as we finally approach filming day. And I think that this would be the perfect time to chat about these official cast announcements before we unpack some of those unauthorized and crazy rumors. <laughs> People Magazine broke the news about Marlo Hampton officially leaving The Real Housewives of Atlanta after putting in all of those years to earn a peach, leaving fans of the show honestly a little relieved. So what? <laughs> Milo took to her Instagram account to share the news to her Hamptons, saying, My contract with The Real Housewives of Atlanta ended when season 15 wrapped. This break from The Real Housewives of Atlanta is a fresh start, allowing me the space to participate in new creative entertainment projects focused on my future and not reliving my past. My nephews are transitioning into pivotal stages of their academic adolescence, and I am focused on my representation in their eyes. I look forward to my continued relationship with Bravo and NBC Universal, and I wish the Real Housewives of Atlanta cast all the best. XOXO, Marlo Hampton. With Saya commenting under the post talking about, you are forever that girl with the high five emoji. And I'm like, Sonya, girl, <laughs> just stop because we know your tea. <laughs> I hate to be like that, y'all, but I mean, come on. Like, it goes without saying, Sonya is not coming back. Oi, no. you can't take a joke. It's not a funny one, though. Piss off. <laughs> Andy Cohen went on his radio show and shared his thoughts on Marlo's firing a few days later. Uh, I love Marlo. And, yeah, cool. you know... You know, no one has had a run on the Housewives like she's had in that she was a friend for so many years and she was such a great friend. And I just feel like the whole thing is so nice nasty because y'all come on, like, we are not slow. Obviously they let our girl walk and I feel like, you know, apparently they just decided to at least let her walk away from the show with her dignity. I will say this, I hope that we have not seen the last of Marlo Hampton. And I have a feeling we have it. And this honestly kicked me into overdrive, trying to figure out what in the hell is going on with The Real Housewives of Atlanta season 16, because honestly, at this point, it's kind of given reboot. <laughs> but I recently decided to take a break from researching Real Housewives of Atlanta T. And I actually decided to Google myself just to see what comes up. And I am shook. Of course, I make videos on the internet for a living. So there was no surprise that I found all of my binge worthy videos, but I was not expecting to find all my tea out there too. And it really makes me uncomfortable. And honestly, it really kind of pissed me off because like, who? What and like how? Well, that's all thanks to data brokers. They're the ones selling all of our tea to anyone willing to pay. They give up our name, our email address, addresses, health records, and even your family's information. Apparently, it's all free game. But Aura's got my back by sniffing out those sneaky data brokers and hitting them with opt out requests faster than you can say please. So shout out to Aura for making today's video possible. It's really like having my own bodyguard for my personal information. After cleaning up my information, it has reduced the amount of spam that I get. And God only knows what other online threats that it has protected me from that I don't even know about, like 
people trying to access my social media and my bank accounts. And I love that Aura comes with other built-in features like antivirus, VPN, and identity theft protection without me having to put in all that extra effort. And it's all at one affordable price. And look, I get it. You probably already have one or two of these tools already, but having Aura is like closing the front door and forgetting to lock both locks. And y'all remember how our mamas used to be like, boy, you left my door wide open. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to do that. I care about my privacy and I care about yours too. Just head over to Aura.com backslash bingeworthy to start your two week free trial. We all know by now that Bravo announced that Portia would be returning to The Real Housewives of Atlanta for season 16. And at the time, we were really looking forward to finally seeing what Portia's new life looked like as a married woman living a whole new life. Portia Gravadia is in the building. <laughs> See y'all. But then a week later, Everything came crashing down, leaving both fans of the show and the entire network completely blindsided by the news that Portia and Simon are actually getting a divorce. And if you watch my last video, you already know that I have been over here screaming y'all because you literally cannot make this stuff up. Now, I don't know if it's always 100% accurate, but I checked Simon's following list on Instagram and it appears that he is no longer following Portia Williams. Oh no, 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 no. Now I know that this paints a different picture than the one that he's trying to portray, but I took screenshots of both of their pages before all of this went down. I mean, let me ask the audience. And now it's showing that Simon has already started removing posts on Instagram. And y'all, I really think that a lot of these posts that were being removed were photos and videos of him and Portia. How could you do this to me? Question mark. And y'all, I'm shook. Like, what happened to him loving Portia until their divorce is finalized? And hell, what happened to their vows? You don't have an answer? Didn't think you would. And y'all, I was so shocked when I found out from a really reputable source that Bravo actually has not started filming The Real Housewives of Atlanta season 16. You better be joking. And that means that they did not catch any of the raw reactions from the girls when they found out for the first time that Portia was getting a divorce. But let's not be silly. Like, I don't know if they gonna fake it or if they just gonna like have them film on their iPhones or whatever, but we know they're gonna figure it out. So let's talk about The Real Housewives of Atlanta season 16 predictions. Now, I am 100% certain that Portia Williams and Kenya Moore will both be returning for the new season. And even though Bravo hasn't made any official announcements about Kenya Moore, my sources have confirmed that Kenya is definitely holding a beat. Now, the neighborhood talk has been putting in so many overtime hours, digging up all the Real Housewives of Atlanta tea, and they claim that they have all the deets about this new cast. According to their close sources, they say that the official cast consists of familiar faces like Portia, Kenya, Shamia, and Drew. They're also saying that newbies Angela Reed, Akila Coleman, and Britt Eady are joining the group. Now, I wasn't able to dig up any real information on Angela or Britt, but we have seen Akila make a few appearances in the past with Kenya Moore on the show. And this number of new girls is definitely in line with other popular casting rumors. I don't know, I just feel like it's just way too early to tell. And I'm gonna wait until I see some of those photos with Freddie O's logo, <laughs> letting me know that he was there for an all cast event because that's when it's real, y'all. When we see those first group photos, that's when it's like official in my eyes. So for right now, I just, I just don't know. Although we can only take these casting rumors with a grain of salt, Andy Cohen did say that they are definitely casting new girls and that he feels really, really good about the new season of Atlanta Housewives. We've got wonderful casting. Uh, we've got some amazing new gals. I'm feeling very positive about the new season of Atlanta. Are you sure? Comment right now and tell me what you guys think about all this. Do you still have a good feeling about The Real Housewives of Atlanta season 16? Or do you think that it's so obvious that they are still scrambling behind the scenes? 
Also, let me know if you still think that there is a chance that they will bring Phaedra Parks back. No, I, I don't even know why she would say that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video all the way to the end. I am so excited that our girls are about to start filming soon. And I really, really hope that they can figure everything out so that we can get this new season around November, just like the good old days, because I have no shame in saying that I am definitely fiending for our Atlanta girls. <laughs> also, thanks again, Aura, for sponsoring today's video. You guys should really check out the link in my description box below so that you can stop data brokers from exposing your personal information. Thanks again for watching. I will see y'all potential housewives on the next one. I'm trying to cop a milli while I keep my soul intact Been through a lot, I learned to adapt Never let struggles make me snap Around the world, about to be on max Got a cute face, but it seemed like a trap Pockets on glow, soul on no In a chateau, counting up big dough uh, Your spirit on the gurney, about the plateau Snake in the grass